Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this episode of the Dan Dawson Show. I know four, right? Four in a row. So, Tink Uger from the Young Turks has gone after Tim Pool. They want him pulled down off of YouTube. And if you watch, I watch Tim Pool every day. Um, I'm in the Pacific Northwest. His show starts at five here. Um, his live show, I make sure I t tune in. But they want him pulled down off YouTube. They even brought in some fake professor looking scrub, right? And there's a reason they have to do that, see? Because they can't have dissenting voices. Tim Pool is a dissenting voice. Much the kid is much like me. Hope he doesn't get mad about me calling him a kid. But I'm almost fifty. I think he's in his early thirties. He's like my daughter's age. It's like, yeah, you're still a kid. So, anyway, but he's right. He's very intelligent. He speaks in a very controlled manner. And he's right about a lot of the stuff he says, or at least I agree with him. Maybe we're both wrong. I don't know. But a lot of stuff he says I agree with. A lot of stuff you heard me say on this channel, I heard it on the Tim Pool Show. So the Young Turks have gone after Tim Pool, because much like the Nazis of 1936, liberals nowadays, they can't socialism, socialists. Remember, the, the original Nazi party, party was called the Nazi Socialist Party. And now we have the Democrat Socialist Party. It's not a coincidence, people. But they can't have dissenting voices. Nobody else can have an opinion unless you agree with them. Now, if they can go after Tim Pool, a multimillionaire, Smart kid. What do you think they'll do to your dissenting voice? Hey, keep your powder dry. All right, thank you for watching this episode of the Dan Dawson Show. Like, subscribe, share. Keep your powder dry. And as always, do what you got to do.